it made me realize that um, I could come out on the other end better as an individual. So. I think that's a good way of looking at it. This local mother of three shares her story from homelessness to now having a career all thanks to the Empowerment Plan. And you may have heard of the Empowerment Plan, a nonprofit that makes coats for the homeless while providing training and jobs for Detroit's homeless population. We reported on the nonprofit when it first began, but tonight we want to check back in to have a look at the progress and the lives that have been changed, all thanks to one woman's dream. Karen Drew has the story. I needed a place to stay. I was desperate. 36 year old Ebony Sharper remembers what it was like walking into this Detroit homeless shelter just a couple years ago. I was crying and I had a trash bag with all of my belongings. Well, the 11 pieces of clothes that they said that we could bring in. After a bad relationship and losing her job, Ebony and her children had nowhere to go. I wasn't getting employment easily. And so uh, at the time, the empowerment plan came into the shelter. The empowerment plan is a nonprofit that makes coats that turn into sleeping bags for the homeless. Made by those struggling through homelessness. Ebony was hired and from that moment, her life changed. By getting that job, how did it change your life? Oh man, you just have no idea. Um, well, it opened up the door for a lot of opportunities. The idea came from Veronica Scott as a class assignment. She remembers where they started. In a utility closet inside of a shelter, um, and that's where it began. I think we made a couple hundred coats that entire first year. <laughs> we were not very efficient. Now the empowerment plan has moved to this 21,000 square foot warehouse. Now what makes the program so special? Not only do they provide jobs for the homeless, but they give them training and support to stop the poverty cycle. We've impacted over 70 people, hired over 70 individuals. One of the 70 helped was Ebony. Turned into a career, so that's a good thing. Because you don't think that most jobs would turn into a career, but it's a career. The local mom was dedicated. She took three buses to get to her job every day, taking nearly two hours each way. But she did it for an opportunity to learn, to earn money, and to provide for her children. We'll give people the opportunity, but it's up to them to take it. And she has taken it and run with it. Um, and she also is so excited about the company as a whole and sees the culture of it and sees that it's not about just her, it's also the, the people that are coming behind her, the people that are next that we could help. In all, the Empowerment Plan has distributed about 35,000 coats and distributed them in the states and throughout the world. The nonprofit continues to get attention from all types of media. On this day, we caught up with Mallory Brown shooting a global fundraiser here. Ebony hustled. I mean, she hustled. In hopes of raising money to help the empowerment plan empower more women like Ebony. I look at Monday in a different way now, so. As we walk the sidewalk she used to walk to the homeless shelter, Ebony says she's forever changed and forever grateful. So from that experience that you went through, how did it make you better? It made me realize that um, I could come out on the other end better as an individual. So I think that's a good way of looking at it. Ebony's advice, you want to want success as bad as you want to breathe. If you would like to help out the Empowerment Plan, we did post a link to the global fundraising project that just started for the Empowerment Plan on our website. Click on Detroit.com. I'm Karen Drew, Local 4 News.